Hi David, how you doing? I've got your poster lined up right over here and I want to talk a little bit about this. Um, okay, so the first thing I want to say is I'm, I'm, I'm going to maintain um, my position from last week uh, and I'm, I'm going to give you a little bit more information because I, I'm, I'm really surprised you elected to continue on this visual direction. I highly, highly, highly recommend you stop right now and reformulate your concept. Why? Because, okay, design school is working towards an end, and basically that end is your portfolio. Your portfolio will be your, your, your result of design school. You'll show people it's your tangible result. As such, your portfolio should be impeccable. One of the, the problems of this kind of work that you're doing is that it's it's not original work so therefore it can't be used towards that end your portfolio do you see what i mean um so when it comes time to put your portfolio together you're going to be looking this or your portfolio teacher is going to say hey man this is an original work okay so you either got to really reconsider this for originality or at the very least you have to credit this because it's frankly it's not your design OK, and, and I'm, I'm, I don't mean to be sounding like a like a uh, like I'm preaching. I really don't. I'm trying to teach you. So um, let me just bring up this, you know, this. And this is what I would say. I would go like this if I were looking at this in a portfolio, which. Come on now. OK, I would go like this. I would say, OK, that's identical. I'm, well, the type's different. It's a little bit of a different typeface, but I mean, it's, it's identical it, that the logo itself has basically identical and the this looks like the same typeface as that so we really don't have any progress here i mean you haven't shown me any techniques that we've learned in the first week of the course the first two weeks of the course okay and let me show you what i mean if we go over to the book itself and i just want to take a look at the, the, the i want to take a look at the, the chapters um thus far that we were responsible for geometric shapes that was a good one that had to do with that uh shapes exercise that you guys did during week two and then we have uh um 21 now this is the biggie david this is the biggie okay because this is drawing with the pen tool um which is going to give you a lot of very very cool um, ways to go about illustration and this exercise right here is outstanding and the, and the reason I say it's outstanding is blow by blow here it is it shows you how to add depth and dimension right into this this wonderful little very simple illustrated knife of course the next step would be to put the little rivets in the handle right so I mean it's and then maybe a little labeled I you know it's it's not that difficult once you start really looking at it as a step-by-step -step building process where you're basically doing this thing of adding shapes um, combining shapes to make new shapes okay um, so really take a look at the reading and I, you know I really want you to reconsider this um, I I I'm a AIGA portfolio reviewer, and I have been for about the last 10 years. So I look at, you know, and in here at my studio, I hire a lot of designers. I mean, I look at probably 3,000 portfolios a year, and th this is something that comes up. So, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm just I'm highly recommending that you consider a new direction, okay? If you have any questions, um, please get with me. I, I, would, I don't want there to be any kind of plagiarism, plagiarism issues or anything like that in the work. And, and right now there, there is. Um, and again, I'm not trying to scare you. I'm not trying to sound like a D word. I'm just saying, um, um, you know, it's, 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 it's time to reconsider uh, a little bit more of a creative approach. So show your personality, okay? If you have any questions, please get with me. I'm not trying to give you more work to do, but I'll be glad to work with you through the process. And um, if you need me, I can make uh, instructional videos, whatever you want, man. But okay. Um, all right, cool. Thanks, Dave.